Hey guys, Christina Nichols for IDA TV with bodybuilder Ryan Nelson, who believes that you can be vegan and still be a bodybuilder. I love that. Um, Ryan, tell me about your journey about becoming a bodybuilder and then how and then how veganism was incorporated. All right. Yeah, I'm at, I'm so I'm from Bighorn, Wyoming, uh, population 119. So definitely a culture there where it's all meat and potatoes and grew up a hunter, fisher, farmer, rancher. Uh, athletics were a big part of my lifestyle. And as I moved into college football, progressed into professional football, and then into my early 20s, I really started to think after three weeks on a plant-based vegan diet that maybe it wasn't necessary to consume animals anymore. And when I felt so much different physically, I felt stronger and mentally more clear, I really started to question why I had been eating animals. And when I started doing the numbers in my head, and it was six animals a day, and at the end of the week it was, you know, like 42 animals, and at the end of the year it was almost 1,500 animals that were being sacrificed for what? Like, I felt better on a vegan diet. It wasn't the taste because I had been eating all these good vegan foods, and I was like, no, this doesn't close your food groups down. This expands it to all these new foods like quinoa and lentils and all these different foods. And so it was at that moment, um, three weeks into experimenting with plant-based food, that then I went ethical vegan. And yeah, it's just been the best change that I've ever made in my whole life. I've got this awesome community that we've really been trying to bring a lot of awareness right now to what's going on out there. And right now it's the biggest social justice revolution in the world. I would call it one of the biggest, not one of the only, but one of the biggest. And um, yeah, right now we're just really trying to bring awareness and uh, show that you can build muscle on a plant-based vegan diet. How do you recommend people do that? Yeah, so um, I think my number one tip is just make sure you're getting enough food in calorie wise because there is a difference in the amount of volume in our in our perception. Animal products are very dense and small where you'll see vegan people eating these huge massive meals but really the calories are the same so just understanding how many calories you're eating and then um, below that there's the macronutrients, your carbs, protein, fat and the beautiful thing about a vegan diet is all the micronutrients so that's something to really gain from a vegan diet is all the micronutrients what are some of the micronutrients oh some of the good micronutrients just um that's a really good question <laughs> i was um, like i'm putting you on the spot yeah, maybe you are putting me on the spot um it's a little uh, bit more science-based it's okay yeah, we could do our research we're gonna on come that back to that one <laughs> anything else you'd like to add about your journey as a vegan bo bodybuilder um i would just say you know like that it was really uh, a scary change for me at first but but also on the flip side i'm like why didn't i do this earlier it was um it was really a life-changing experience and the choice is always yours to to change that plate you know from animal meat, uh, animal food to uh, plant-based food and i just really suggest you do that as soon as you could because it changed my life in such a positive way Thank you so much, yeah, Ryan. Absolutely. Christina Nichols for ID8 TV.